Hello, this is Riot Dreams coming at you with something a little bit new, a little bit different. Uh, this game, Nine Days, just came out on March the 8th, um, and it has been getting a little bit of negative reviews, and I think that might be an understatement. Uh, one that's really stood out to me was one dude bought it after his son recommended it to him, and then he said after 20 minutes of playing it, he disowned his son and that he misses him. Um, yeah, so immediately after that, I downloaded the game. Uh, <laughs> honestly, I I've only seen like two videos before getting the game, okay? And it looked pretty cool. That's all. That It just looked amazing. And I'm sure there's a lot of people who've been waiting on this game, kind of had an idea in their head or maybe some expectations that were set that may not be living up to that idea. Um, I never had those expectations. I just saw this game like literally when it came out. I saw it and I got it. Um, so that shows how much thought I put into a lot of decisions, but honestly, I've been having a lot of fun. Another thing I just want to quickly say is the creator has already put out an update for the game. I think it was yesterday or the day before, and it has greatly improved and changed some of the game, and I've just been enjoying it and loving the game so far. Um, we're gonna hop into this. I'm not gonna take up too much of your time talking about the game. Uh, I think it's just better to fucking play the game. I, I, yeah. So we're gonna go on this journey together. I have played the game a bit. I'm not, this isn't my first look or anything, but, uh, yeah. One other thing I want to say just before hitting that confirm button is my computer is not great. I use integrated graphics. I am poor. I don't have a lot of money. This is the setup I got. This is the setup I use. So if anything looks bad, please don't let it reflect on the game. Look up some game footage from, honestly, other people. Uh, Stashtastics, who I've been seeing, and honestly, great guy, great videos, would recommend. And yeah honestly game looks a lot better than you'll see here i'm running it on low settings and even then my pc has trouble sometimes so if anything happens please don't blame the game my computer's a shit now we're j gonna just jump into this and we are playing nine days uh it, it will always start you with the tutorial honestly this is one of the most infuriating things about the game uh because when i was first figuring things out and just trying to get my bearings and like i restarted a few times i did this tutorial way too much i i know this shit it's the 11th okay I, this game hasn't been out long got your dash oh man i just love the dash in this man like oh oh shit just jumping around fuck it yeah. oh melee attack i don't know something just things feel nice in this game I, I think they do. I like how things feel. I can do like a super punch here. I don't think I was supposed to do my super punch yet. Aw, oh, yeah! Now this is one of the new things in the updates. Uh, they added leveling up. Yeah, that wasn't a thing when the game came out. You could not level up. And yeah, I have I had a save where I only had like so little energy. Because when you level up, it gives you more energy. Absorption beam. Little skill menu here. Do different loadouts. One thing I would like to see, if possible, more loadouts, but that that's just me. Uh, I got lots of buttons to do, because you change the loadouts with, like, your numbers. I got lots of numbers on my, my keypad. Lots of, lots of loadout possibilities. Ah, here we go. Now, now, the base premise of this game that I've taken so far is everything has energy or experience, and you want the best... You want as much experience as possible, but the best energy as possible. Quantity doesn't necessarily matter as much when it comes to your energy, um, because it really depends what you want to build. Uh, you, whatever you absorb into yourself will become your stats. You can just highlight over it to see which stat is affected. Your experience bar is here, and this will show you how much energy you can currently have. You can stack them, so the more bedrock, the more bedrock you'll see here, and the higher the stats you'll see related to bedrock. New skill! Now it's gonna walk us through some shit, but fuck that. We know what to do here. We, we've played the game before. This isn't my first time going about it. So we're just gonna switch to my second loadout and recover some energy here. We're gonna get our energy bomb and we're just gonna chuck that shit. Now watch, watch this, watch this. Ow! Beautiful. Damn. Whoa! 
what a way to start a game. Blowing up a planet and shit. God damn. Now we're gonna be spawning into existence. Just a naked man living our naked lives. How you doing? Um, I don't I don't know if people like it when I read to them. I'm not the greatest reader, so I'll let you guys do that for yourself. I'll give you guys a summary pretty much of what's being said. So essentially, she's like, hey, you remember what's going on? The world is under attack. There's some great enemy, some dude named Tim, or that's who they refer to this guy as, and he's coming in nine days. We have nine days to train, and we gotta, we gotta get shit done, okay? Um, yeah, we gotta get stronger, we gotta get ready for this big bad that's coming in nine days. First mission, we gotta clear out the castle, because there's a bunch of bugs there, so we can set up camp. They're counting on us. Nobody else is out there. Nobody else can fight this man, okay? There may be some strong people who think they can, but yeah. Uh, if you talk to this guy, if, it, if it'll let us. Okay. You know, fuck that guy. He, he essentially tells you, hey, go out into the world and get some energy. So do you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna go out into the world and we're gonna get some energy. Now anything pretty much gives you energy want like that grass if you want that boulder there are certain things you can absorb but that's yeah. I don't know why literally you can like literally fucking absorb planets and suns and shit there are some things you can't absorb which yeah, it's part of it's part of life you can't you can't absorb everything in life okay so now you can see that I picked up some energy I got a bunch of grass we're gonna actually get a little bit more you'll see why I'm doing this in a second Maybe not a sec, in a little bit. This this will make sense in a, in a bit. Because we're going to play the game. We're not going to play the game how we should play the game. We're going to play the game how we will play the game. How we, how we really should play the game. You know what I'm saying? There's like, how the game wants you to play, and then there's the right way to play. And then, fuck this guy. I just like using the skills. I See, this is what I'm... The game's not perfect, okay, guys? It's not... It's not... But it is fantastic. Uh, if you want to go fast too, you can, uh, can dash. Quite a bit of a boost. Sometimes you even get like a little speed run after it. Um, many ways to clear these guys out. Again, I like having energy. If you can gather a bunch of these fuckers up at once, you know, you just go like, hey, hey, hey come here. Hey, you. Hey, I'm over here now. Yeah, we're all going here. I guess that's only two. Oh, let's get three. Let's get, hey, hey. Yeah. Yeah. Then you go, uh, kind of get the middle of the group here, you know. So, do that shit. Then charge. In the meantime, they come back. They go, ah. Another one. Pow. Charge in the meantime. Then you go, ah, another one. Yeah. And then you just charge. One of the hardest things I've found is just finding shit when I get sick. And it's kind of been fun just overcoming it. At the same time, I kind of want to be that. I, I want to give back and kind of show things I've found. I'm not necessarily going to do a tutorial style video, but hopefully you can at least take some things out of my gameplay and just have a better time playing the game. It doesn't tell you a lot of what there is to do, and I feel like there's just still work to be done and things kind of missing, but it doesn't mean you still can't play the game and have a great time. Again, it's $20. Spend the money. It's not bad. Man, there's so much shit coming out that's like $60, $80. I think this is okay. And it's not... It's I have a lot of fun. But you decide for yourself. If you enjoy watching it, do the trip. Oh, uh, okay, now, one of the most broken things in the game right now is the hoverboard. And let me, let me show you why in just a second. So, yeah, here, we'll, we'll trigger the next quest. We're actually gonna do something else here. I actually don't really like that. I don't know what I mean. Um, yeah, so we're gonna talk to you. Evening. Yep, and essentially what she's gonna be telling me here is, hey, good work on that at the castle. You need to go to the coastland ruins and you need to talk to this chick named Ma. She's gonna have some sort of thing for you to do. She's gonna give you the hoverboard, which is weird. We already have the hoverboard. I don't know why she says that, but that's okay. Um, and then she's gonna give us a quest, and th that's gonna be a later thing. We're actually not even gonna fuck with that for a little bit here. Because, uh, 
there's something much more important to make this game more fun to play that I like to do right off the bat. Let's pick up some meals. Uh, while you're here, might as well just run up here. Um, I like this a lot. There's a, it's called Dragon Rock. And it gives you, I believe, uh, health and energy for absorbing it. A few of these around the world, but for now, this is like the first time you can get it, and honestly, not a, not a bad find. Um, energy is gonna be your blue bar too, so there's like energy for what you absorb, and then like, that's gonna be your capacity here. But when you get energy here, like in your stat, that actually affects your blue bar and how much like. Is that what I think that is? Shit! See, it's 16 out of 45. Underneath the blue bar, you'll see a little white bar. I think that's our experience bar. That wasn't there. That wasn't a th oh, sh thing before. So let me show you why the hoverboard's broken. Um, so yeah, you can't do anything on it. It seems like it's a broken item that doesn't work, and I think it might be. But. After a lot of trial and error, I've actually figured out how you can kind of use it. So if you're on like a high surface, don't turn whatsoever. You can only go straight. But right now, I don't know if there's another hoverboard. I never found it. I'd, honestly, we're going to go do something where the hoverboard's not going to matter in about a second here. Um, but to use the hoverboard, in case you're wondering, you jump, you do it, and then you hold shift, it'll give you a boost. And as long as you don't turn or do anything, you'll, you'll stay on it. Yeah, I think you can move the mouse, just don't, just don't turn, and it kind of works. Does it work good? No, look how slow I'm going. There's much better ways of traveling around, and, and my computer is shit. It doesn't like the hub, okay? So what we're gonna do is we're actually going to go towards the coastland ruins, we're gonna pick up a new skill, and then we're gonna fight the world guardian. World Guardian is essentially like the world boss, he's like the big honcho, and once you beat him, you can unlock a really cool skill, which is flight. And, and that's... That, that makes the game playable, okay? Like, not that it's not playable before you get flight, it's actually, I had a lot of fun traversing the map, but it's... but it's not... I prefer flight, it's so much faster. You know, it's kind of like Skyrim before you discover shit, and, and then you gotta walk across the map. No one likes that shit, okay? Maybe some people like that shit, but it, it gets boring. Why do that when you can fly, okay? Now, how I'm gonna do this, you don't have to do it. You can play the game how you're supposed to play the game, and I won't fault you. Play it how you wanna play it, or you're gonna cheese the fuck out of this place. Machine Blast. Dodging there, and then throw a punch in there. So now we got machine blast, you just kind of come here, you, you, you get it, okay? Go towards the coastland ruins, there's a sign, I'll show you the sign in a sec. Right, so, so to get the skill, let's go here. Coastland ruins, you go up there. Now, you can also go to the coastland ruins by going through the guardian, but you don't, because one, you won't get the skill, and if you're trying to play the game authentically, I think you can, honestly. It's not that hard to get by the Guardian. But this is where the world boss is. This is where we're gonna learn how to fly. This is where we're gonna become the top shit of the world. Take a little rest here so it saves. Switching loadouts so you got that machine blast. Now, earlier, we were getting a bunch of energy, and we had five grass. We actually... I think we want to have, like, six grass. I don't know if that's the case, and there's actually other ways to do this. I just haven't taken the time because this way is efficient. So you come here. Now, once you get to about this little lip thing, you want to crouch. And once you see this rock, you know you're doing it right. So we approach this shit here. You see, you see the motherfucker over there. He's just sitting. You aim with your aimers. Really bad at aiming. Give me a second. And from this.
this spot, he won't get to He doesn't see us. He doesn't feel us. Just chill. Alright. There you go. Guardian defeated. Look at that. Now we can fly. I can't. There we go. Okay. So you go to skills. You, you, you get rid of the hoverboard immediately because it's terrible. And uh, you also should level up after that. So look, we have a bunch more energy we can store. Um, and yeah. Uh, flying, you just press forward, save with the hoverboard, and now the game is fun. What is this? Oh shit! Equip. Oh man. Look at my ass. Shit. But now that the Guardian is dead, we can actually travel the map in style, and we're gonna go to the Coastland Ruins, which is just over here. Oh wait, 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 wait. Actually, while we're here. While we're Goku, let's, uh, let's go right here. Hell yeah. Just real quick, get yourself a uh, bandana. I don't know if the items are set, like you always get the same thing from every chest, or if it's different, like randomized. Eel's kind of randomized so far, but hey. We're gonna go to the ruins. Uh, if you ever don't know where to go, um, later on in the game this is less applicable, but right now while we're on the starting planet, Anytime you block, it actually will tell you. It'll give you like little red markers and start. And really convenient, really nice. I like it. This is blast off. Whoosh! Hey, what up, big? And uh, yeah, this is the Coastland Ruins. Um, I'm gonna go over here and talk to this dude. What's up? Oh, what's up, Ma? Yeah, she did. So essentially, she's gonna be like, hey got sent by Nepto, that's cool, but we got a little bit of a problem. A lot of our men went into this creepy bunker, and none of them have came back. Can you go do something about it? By the way, there's a hoverboard in the chest behind you. I'm not reading it, like, word for word, but that, that's essentially what she thought she did, so. When you just jump in here, you can honestly just fall and fly if you really want. Alright, so now we're in the bunker. Some ore there you can grab if you want. I'm not going to. It's uh, I think it's dark or shadow, and it's not it's not the energy I, I tend to. Really like. Some uh, dudes here. This chick's gonna say, hey, there's a ghost, I'm scared. Ooh. Again. The ghost is just right here, and as you can see, I'm, it's not that strong. I'm fucking up pretty good just with my uh, machine gun blast. So some good energy. <laughs> Kill that guy. I like to keep an eye on my experience. So there's a relic here, it says to steal it, do that shit, we want to steal the fuck out of it. Sweet, okay. Um, dumb. I like this shit, this is bronze here. Um, I want to say it gives you just health, but it might also give you energy. I'll, tell you, I'll show you guys in a second, we'll find out. You also want to see down here the uh, absorption beam will light up this place like a, like no tomorrow, so you can see the details. Oh, what is... Oh, that's a roll. Okay, I thought it would be equipment. I thought it would be... Yeah, my bad. And yeah, honestly, since they've added leveling up to the game, it's just been so much more Like, the, before they patched the game, you couldn't level up at all, except for, like, I think doing certain events or something, or only certain things, like, gave you XP. So my first playthrough, I only had, like, a capacity of 8, and I was trying to fight, like, the second, uh, Guardian of a different planet. And it just wasn't working. And then they added the level up, and I just felt like we got. I will say at times it does feel a little too broken, but that's also because I, I kind of play the strengths, the skills that I'm using. But this guy's dead, we can just walk around. We sh that should be everybody. Uh, the dungeon should be clear, that's
that's really all we gotta do here. How are you? Hey, yeah. How are you? What's up? How are you? Oh, How are you? Are you? Are you? What's up? Now she's gonna tell us to fight the Guardian. Little does she know we already fought the Guardian. Talk so, soon. Yeah, for the best. Um, next thing you want to do that I'd recommend... Oh, shit. Is get, get some energy so we can fly faster. Uh, we're gonna go to the dojo. We're gonna learn how to fight. Um, he's gonna teach us some skills that are cool. And, uh... Yeah! And it's been day one! Shit. Well, honestly, I think we're gonna end this one here. You know what? Yeah, that, that's a that's a that's a video. Next video, we're gonna go fight the dragon. We're gonna go join the dojo. And uh, yeah, thanks for joining us. This has been Ra Errings coming at you with a nine days gameplay, uh, let's play kind of thing. I don't even know. A little bit of tutorial too. And uh, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, if you want more on this, please like, comment, let me know what you think, and yeah, take care, and uh, take it easy.